Well, we know Trump is the beast out of the sea. That's the Antichrist. And a shark is the beast out of the sea, which they showed us an iPad goat right there on the chalkboard. And that's what Jaws was about. And why Bill Maher always references Trump as that shark that from um, Jaws that he just keeps coming back. You know how he's coming back, you know. So this new Live Golf, which is, of course, Greg Norman is the president or whatever he's about to say. And Greg Norman's nickname was The Shark. And, of course, the Saudis are involved and who who was allegedly, supposedly responsible for the twin Trumps falling down back in the year 2001, A Space Odyssey, in the year Donnie Darko came out. But, of course, uh, that country is involved in this, and they do play at Trump's golf course in Bedminster at the end of July. I formulated into an actual plan and now we have the Live Golf Tour, which is backed by some some of the Saudi Arabia money, which is where a lot of the controversy has come in. Uh, Greg Norman, serving as the CEO, has had to field a lot of the questions about where the money is actually coming from. So now you get the idea, right? We know that all the world's a stage, Back to the Future 2. They, writers, producers, direct, they all admit that the Biff character with the casino, like Trump's casino, is all based off Donald Trump. He had the big gold money sign on his desk, Biff did, just like Trump. You know, money, 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 his TV show. You know, that was the song by the OJ. It's their whole world is scripted by the AI, artificial intelligence, which writes the script, which makes songs, music videos, movies, TV shows, even the Trump that got shot, who was going to build a wall and save everybody from 1958. Um, every bit of it. You know, Trump being on Jimmy Fallon on September 11th. And of course, Fallon was the name of one of the uh, the clones. One was real, one was cloned from um, the movie The Prestige, which was Christian Bale, which played Batman, which Trump said he's Batman, and he posed with Christian Bale as they used Trump Tower in the Dark Knight Rises movie. All the world's a stage, folks. Even the sports stuff, everything that you watch, the whole Nick Saban, Jimbo Fisher, Fiasco? Yes, they played this year on October 8th, which is 88. Oct October was once the was once the eighth month, like No Time to Die last year, was released on the on October 8th for 88, 88 miles per hour. Trump comes to 88 in Gematria. The whole nine yards. You can't make it up. If I could just sit around and make this stuff up, I mean, nah. All the world's a stage. We just uh what was the guy's name? Uh, hang on. Tom Hanks. He played that character, Robert Langdon, in The Da Vinci Code, which is all about just connecting dots and following their clues. That's all we do. It's that simple.